When will my white blood cell counts recover after transplant? Eventually, the low white blood cell count will recover on its own uh, when the new stem cells are basically going to be making new white blood cells. That process takes anywhere from 7 to uh, 14 days. We can accelerate that process by giving a growth factor, the same growth factor we use to mobilize stem cells from the blood called GCSF. We use it after the transplant. At our center, we start it around day 7 when the stem cells have had a chance to expand a little bit, and then we kick them into gear. And usually within 3 to 4 days of giving those injections, white blood cell count recovery is hastened by those injections by two to three days on average. How many days will I be immunocompromised after transplant? The uh, biggest risk period is for about uh, a week after the transplant where the blood counts are very, very low. The gut has been damaged by the melphalan chemotherapy. There's lots of bacteria that live within our intestine. So most patients that get infections during that period, they have translocation of bacteria from their intestine into their bloodstream through little holes that have been created by the damage from the chemotherapy. So that's the biggest period of immunocompromise up front. Uh, once the blood counts have recovered, uh, patients uh, are generally in a much better place as far as their immune system, but there are probably still some holes in their immune system. Their ability to fight viruses is not as strong. They might be more susceptible to colds and flus. Typically after the transplant procedure, we start vaccinating them for diseases that you know, are typically uh, seen in childhood like diphtheria, pertussis, and they go through a series of vaccination over a period of two years. The other uh, viruses that can be problematic are herpes viruses, so cold sores, shingles can be a problem. There is a new shingles vaccine that can be administered early after the procedure that can decrease the risk of shingles reactivation. We also recommend prophylaxis with antivirals uh, for at least one year after the transplant procedure because that's the main one we worry about. But most of the time, about a month after the transplant, I let my patients travel. Um, you know, I let them get back to their life to do what they want to do because that's why they went through the transplant procedure to get back to their lives. We do caution them about uh, avoiding certain foods like moldy cheese and things that uh, are not cooked very well. But washing hands and avoiding sick contacts, usually most people uh, don't have any major difficulties with uh, immune compromise. When can I go out in public after transplant? So I don't recommend masks in public. Um, if, if it makes patients feel more comfortable, uh, I tell them go ahead. Uh, but unless you're wearing one of those military grade masks that purifies the air, there's no way par every particle is gonna be eliminated. I let them go out into public very early after the procedure. So as, long, as soon as they're discharged from our transplant program, which sometimes is day 18, 15 to 18 after the procedure, um, you know, I, I tell them they can, you know, they can drive, uh, they can go to the grocery store. I do tell them to avoid large crowds like football games because the more people you're in contact with, the more likely you're going to acquire something. Some people are, need to travel to get back to their home, so uh, patients routinely go to the airport. There are lots of people there. We, we tell them to try to avoid the big crowds. Uh, washing the hands by, by far the number one thing that they can do to avoid infections. So having some Purell or some sort of antibacterial lotion on them at all times and being very anal about that goes a very long way to preventing complications. Each transplant center has its own philosophy or recommendations on how to avoid infection post-transplant. Make sure you have a discussion with your transplant team and follow their recommendations.